Ever wonder how Gen X survived childhood before there was Google ND? Let's take a little walk down memory lane into a Gen X first aid kit. Where if the Holy Trinity couldn't cure you, the Curacomb Vicks and Campo Fenique, well then you were probably fucked. But let's start with the three Hells Angels sent by Satan himself. First up, straight up alcohol. None of that sweet stuff like peroxide for us. No, just the hard stuff. They would hold you down and pour this shit. The devil's hand sanitizer right into your open wounds. Alcohol first and then followed up with a dose of Bactine. Good old spray of this on your scraped knees and your bruised ego after your alcohol bath would have you screaming like a stuck pig in no time. Then comes Macuricomb, also known as monkey's blood. They slathered this red shit on you as part of the ritual of pain. Burned like the devil's breath and left you marked for weeks. For any rash, bug bite, or mysterious skin eruption, you got the pink wonder known as calamine lotion. Left you looking like a pink cast for the ghost on Halloween. Thankfully, this one didn't burn. Then there's bare aspirin, which was basically orange candy. No childproof caps meant a lot of pump stomachs with this one. Then there's the beloved fix vapor rub. This picture getting lubed up with menthol scented Vaseline from head to toe. Left you smelling like a walking cough drop for days. And your skin felt like it'd been prepped for a menthol scented slip and slide. And who knew it was for external use only? Not our parents. Campophonique, iodine, syrup of Epicac, band-aids, cause I'm stuck on band-aids, so band-aids stuck on me. Oh, and I can't forget cough syrup, Cree emulsion. Black as tar and tasted like gasoline. Drawing salve, mentholatum, sucrets. Our parents' medicine chest was a horror show of remedies. Cheers to Gen X, who toughened up without Google and definitely without sympathy.